Hey guys, so I know some of you guys have uh, actually uh, asked me to see my collection, so uh, here he is. Um, okay, so uh, we're going to start with uh, this shelf. This is my uh, animated shelf. So uh, I've been collecting those since the show was out. I actually like the show a lot. Uh, these are my leader class movie shelf. Leader class, leader class Bumblebee, Ironhide. There's the Deluxe Bumblebee and the Voyager Ironhide. The first Voy Voyager Ironhide is actually pretty crap. Uh, so I just decided to keep him in uh, alt mode. Down here, sorry, it's I know it's a little dark. Just uh, bad lighting in my room. Uh, 2007 leader class Bumblebee. I mean uh, Optimus, sorry. There's the Voyager Ratchet, that ugly green thing that I don't don't really like. Uh, wheelie over here, and we got Jazz. As we move lower, here's some more movie figures right here. There's Sentinel Prime. Sorry, the lighting is shit. Uh, there's uh, Megatron. Actually, you know what? Let me pop this door open. Maybe you can see it a little better. Yeah, it's still pretty bad. Uh, right there, we got Barricade. The rest of the uh, movie figures, right there. We got a payload over here, which is such a horrible robot mode, you can barely stand up. Uh, now, this is my Generations shelf, so this is like actually a lot of the stuff from this year. Uh, there's Springer with a Dr. Wu upgrade, so he looks like, just like the comic from Last Stand of the Wreckers. There's Sandstorm with the extra gun that came with the upgrade. Rhinox, Skids, Trail Bra Blazer, Trail Cutter, whatever you want to call them. And here's my uh, fans project, Menasaur, and uh, my Make Toys Nova Prime is actually what got me into third party collecting. And here is my Metroplex. Everyone needs to have a friggin' Metroplex. And there's the Takara Legends uh, Optimus. Just like the IDW version. Scamper. And Bumblebee. These guys' paint jobs are freaking awesome. I love the metallic paint job. And that's why you paid a premium for Takara stuff. And this is... And I got figures falling all over the place. Voyager Soundwave. With Masterpiece Soundwave and his minions. Okay. And here is my Fembot shelf. Let me uh, try to stand uh, Arachnid up. This figure is such a waste. Uh, they did uh, a really bad job executing her. She deserves a better figure. RC Twins. First 2007 RC. RC First Edition, a really great figure. You could tell they designed her extremely well. And here's some Mighty Mugs, Grimlock, Bumblebee, and Optimus. This is actually the Bot, the, uh, uh, I think it's BotCon version. No, Comic-Con version. My sister ordered him online uh, for my birthday. And, uh, Oh crap. This guy which is basically just a remold, retool of Barricade. I forgot who this guy is. Uh, Movie Ravage. Scorpionock. Blackout. Looks awesome. This guy deserves a leader, leader class treat. They should have given him leader class when he came out. Uh, some, uh, I got my device label Grimlock. 
I used that mouse like once. I just bought it because it's Grimlock. Uh, Jetfire and Jetstream from Animated. I forgot who this guy is. Uh, Deluxe Starscream. He came with the uh, leader class Bumblebee. And that cheesy power core combiner. Uh, Hasbro's failed attempt at combiners. Okay. Now, I'm going to move over to my uh, new shelf. This is supposed to be my 2014 shelf and it's filling up really fast. So here's all my AOE stuff. And there's a picture of me and my girlfriend. And some picture at some uh, toy conventions. And uh, here's Beast Fire Predaking that I got for $25 at Walmart because they were on sale. Uh, Generations Blitzwing with the Blitzwing Gun Fix. This is my extra one that I'm actually sending to a really good friend of mine. So now his shoulder is fixed. Looks awesome. Head actually fits in the nose cone now. And uh, this overpriced Ultimate Optimus Prime. Uh, he's uh, not that great. Doesn't even light up right now. He's supposed to. Oh, there he is. Uh, it's okay. It's a kid's toy. Clearly a kid's toy. Not for a collector. But I got him for 10 bucks. <laughs> so I'm not complaining. And uh, that's it for that shelf. I'm going to need to have more because I'm going to be getting a bunch more this year with all the new figures coming out. And one of my favorite pieces, I know it's a toy, but the Calvin Johnson uh, hat, Decepticon hat, the Megatron hat. And uh, that snapback actually glows in the dark. I haven't used this guy yet. And the matching Megatron shoes, CJ81 with the Decepticon logo on the back. These are official. I love my Nikes and I love my Transformer. So when this came out, oh man, I went nuts. And the sole actually glows in the dark as well. Uh, if you guys get a chance to get it, get it. Uh, they're limited edition. You probably won't find more of those guys anyway right now. I actually got lucky with this one. I got this off eBay for close to cost, uh, a few dollars more because they don't sell it anywhere here in Canada. And uh, that actually also comes with a free iPhone 5 Decepticon uh, phone sticker. Uh, mine didn't come with it and I'm sure the owner just took it, uh, the seller took it. it uh, it's supposed to come with it. Uh, so that's it. That's my collection right now, guys. Uh, if you look up here, I still have an unopened Platinum uh, Grimlock and Bruticus. I'm waiting for the Microblaze upgrade that I pre-ordered to come in when, whenever that's released. I'll be doing a re review of that. Here's a bunch of instructions from the new figures that I have this year. That's a present from my ex-girlfriend that I've never opened because I don't like putting stuff together. A box for the rainstorm upgrade. A Christmas present from my sister uh, a couple of years back. I never opened him just because of the reviews that I've seen about this guy. I'm just going to keep him because it's a bad optimist. And uh, here is a present from my aunt because they know I love Transformers. Check that out. Pretty badass. Ooh, I never knew that lit, lit up. <laughs> I had this guy for like a couple of years. That's awesome. And 
here's a bunch of Beast Hunters Prime I got on sale for Walmart for five dollars each. I'm not gonna open these guys. I got these guys just because, well, they're five bucks. <laughs> There's Soundwave, Starscream, Prowl, uh, Sky Stalker, and Laserback. And there's Domo and my metal blitz because I'm a freaking nerd. Um, also have a Transformers toothbrush because that's how much uh, of a nerd I am. I collect everything. Um, yeah, so that's it. Oh, one more thing. I got some Autobot decals here. I was going to put them on my motorcycle when I had one. The Decepticon sticker on my Volvo right now looks badass on black um yeah so that's it guys um if you guys have any questions or comments feel free to leave it in the description below and let me just give you guys a shot of how it looks looks awesome uh, every time i look at this i wake up in the morning I actually it feels good you know, to like a kid again when i'm stressed out from a day at work I just pick one of these guys out, transform him, and uh, yeah, it uh, makes me feel peaceful, <laughs> let's put it that way. Alright guys, and uh, that's it for my collection, looking forward in expanding it this year. Alright, bye.